All right, you see all this right here? You can see my air conditioning, lines, miscellaneous wiring and stuff like that. It's just not attractive. And we wanna have the coolest truck we can get on the road. So today, I'm gonna to show you our solution for this that's not only attractive, but it's gonna help keep your AC and your radiator cooler. You stay tuned, you hear? So how we ran into this situation is we had an old 87 uh, pickup that was just not getting cool enough. The AC just wasn't kicking. So we took it to an old timey AC guy and what he did is he just fabricated up some uh, quickie little uh, block off plates right here. And we stole his idea, came up with uh, a little bit better design, detailed it a little bit more. It's made out of aluminum and it's powder coated black. You can of course paint it any color that you want. And what's going to happen now is instead of the air coming in here, jamming into this and shooting straight up or going back down, this right here is going to take it and it's going to force it straight through your AC uh, condenser here and your radiator. It's, we dropped 10 degrees on our air conditioning and our radiator ran a lot cooler too. So this installs pretty easy, but there's a couple of helpful handy hints I'm going to give you in just a second here. Now I want to get some tape on here because I want to protect my paint. And I need to take off this hood bumper stop first. I don't want to have to realign my hood after the fact. So what I want to do is that I'm going to loosen up this little nut down here a little bit and try to keep it in the same spot. I'll bring it up a little bit and I'll mark it so that it is uh, in the same position. Then I can go ahead and take this off. And if my nut moves on me, I still have my mark on there to keep track. After that's out, I can go ahead and take these bolts off on this side. And I'm just gonna get this up here and see how all my holes are lining up. Everything's looking nice. Before I actually bolt it in though, I'm gonna go ahead and take this edging right here that comes with the kit. It goes on the top edge of this panel right here and it'll just slip on just like this. I'll get that all the way across, I'll trim it to fit nice on the end, and then I can go ahead and install this. The kit comes with these little plastic washers, and the little plastic washers go right here so that we don't damage our nice new bitchin' looking plate. So make sure you use those on there. Another thing you want to do too when you're doing this kind of a job, you heard me say this a thousand times, is all the peripheral stuff that goes with it. So my old bolts here, they were looking pretty tired. I went ahead and got the new assembly bolts at the same time. So now I'm looking good. I'm just gonna get these guys started. I'll snug them up a little bit. I'll get my hood stop in. Then I'll go ahead and do the other side. When I'm tightening things up, I'm not gonna just grab one and start torquing it down. It's tightening up a little bit, tightening up a little bit, and then you'll have a final tighten up. This will keep anything from um, warping on you if you were to get too aggressive when you tighten one down. So I got that kind of snugged up. Let's get the other side and see how good we look. So you can see it's a really simple thing for you to be able to do to modify your truck and look good in no time and increase your air conditioning and your radiator's cooling ability. Make sure you check out our catalog, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, and um, next week I will be back because I'm here to make sure your truck gets back on the road. We'll see you all there, man.